In Stromboli, the release of lava from the northern crater of the volcano continues, the same one from which several pyroclastic flows formed yesterday, accompanied by collapses and landslides along the volcano wall, which gave rise to a tsunami wave of one and a half meters high. The lava flow is currently flowing along Ciara's natural path, reaching the coastline, and appears to be well fed. The Department of Civil Protection yesterday ordered the Stromboli volcano alert level to change from yellow to orange and the activation of the pre-alarm operational phase. After yesterday's storm in the Tyrrhenian region of Messina, which caused problems in the area with overflowing streams, flooded roads, basements and houses, people stuck in cars or houses, sections of the road collapsed, especially in Milazzo and Barcelona Pazo di Gatto, good weather returned today, and it's time to assess the damage. In Milazzo, Mayor Pippo Midaili speaks of huge damage of at least 1 million euros just to infrastructure and municipal roads, but it should be much more, considering also the destroyed private cars. Meanwhile, the fire brigade and civil protection groups are still intervening in Barcelona's Pazo di Gatto, where the most damage has been recorded, to clear roads and cellars. Last night, a section of the A20 motorway, temporarily closed due to bad weather, was reopened.